Hi, I'm Joey, and right now I'm on the ground at a, a wind farm checking out some massive wind turbines, trying not to get blown away. We're outside Cadiz, Spain with G&G. This is pretty amazing, so let's go check it out. Today we're going to see a wind farm, and later on today we're going to go to a solar farm to see in action a lot of different energy resources and understand their importance. These are Gamisa wind turbines. They're 68 meters tall. Each blade weighs six tons. And the actual the head of the windmill is more or less the size of this bus. By having these installations, they avoid the emission of 330,000 tons of carbon dioxide. Spain has a great wind potential, especially along coastal areas, which are helping Spain to get to their goal by 2020 of having 20% renewable energy. America's made its mark in the world by always being on the cutting edge. And for the past eight years, uh, we've, been, we've been slow to get on the ball with alternative energy. And we came to Spain today and saw that Spain's been working on this for a long time. And America's been talking about whether or not global warming's real. It's awesome from an environmental standpoint, obviously, um, but it's also creating a you know, pipeline for jobs and in the rural areas of the country where the standard of living is lower and folks are able to receive some tax monies through the businesses that are being created in the area. For the solar panels, it's not the 11% that in the case of wind, it's only 1% of all the electricity generated in Spain is coming from solar farms. But we're on the right path. So what we're making with solar farms is to make the prices to be cheap enough so that you can install it in your house. And that's the main point. It's the first time I've ever been actually on the ground next to alternative energy sources. And it was a big thrill to be there amongst these beacons of the future. It's about dreams. It's about future. It's about feeling we have uh, some job to do. Europe and USA have the leading roles to make all the economy of the planet change. And the only way to do it is proving that renewable energy is the best economical solution. It struck me how simple the whole operation is. There's no smoke coming out, they're not burning anything. I was really proud to be there today. And this is our generation's time to step up to the plate to press the reset button on the way energy works and the way mankind interacts with the, with, with the Earth. We have a lot of work to do. Today was just a starting point to make you see we have an appointment with future. Are you coming with us?